Okay, hold on. This, here it is. The biggest ship to ever visit America. Benjamin Franklin. CMA, CGM, Benjamin Franklin. We're here today to well, officially welcome the Benjamin Franklin, the largest container ship to ever call here in North America. This crane operator here. This particular guy. Yeah. This crane operator, 40 moves. Right now we have uh, seven cranes that are working. However, the um, capacity of this ship can handle 10 cranes working at one time. I was telling our captain, who's Croatian, that this is the heart of the Croatian community. Yes. It's the heart of the Italian community, the heart of the Greek community, it's the heart of the Latino community increasing. This is the heart and the history of Los Angeles. And now that it's docked in the port of Los Angeles, Eight cranes and over a thousand Angelinos will be working to unload this cargo in about four, four and a half days. An amazing feat. We saw one crane operator who's unloading about 40 boxes an hour. That's nothing short of amazing. You know, average, I think, 180 tons of fuel wow. per day. Wow. Yeah. Now, 180 tons of fuel per day sounds like a hell of a lot. And yes. Not very environmentally friendly, but you have to <laughs> relate that to the number of boxes that you are carrying. And the reality is that you're dealing with about 30, I think it's about 35 grams of CO2 emission per container per kilometer, which is the most uh, efficient uh, mode of transport for a That is incredible. We got four stories worth of engines here. This vessel uh, is already built to the 2025 standards and below, so it's, it's one of the most uh, energy efficient uh, engines that you can find uh, in this industry today. It's about 35 grams of CO2 per container per kilometer, by far the most efficient and most environmentally friendly mode of transport for cargo. This is the first run of this particular vessel, so we're doing testing of protocol throughout the ship's call. Coming in and approaching the Port of Los Angeles to all the on-dock work that we do. Should this ship go into a normal rotation here in the Trans-Pacific Trade at the Port of LA, it will be amp capable all the way through its service. The tour that we just took with the mayor on board the Ben Franklin was just incredible. Um, amazing, it was a constant reminder uh, how much of an impact a ship to this magnitude has in our local job force. Today the ILW is part of this whole operation from the ILW port pilots to our ILW police officers, the ILW security, foremen, marine clerks, longshoremen. This is truly a, a spectacle of ILW cooperation with the Port of Los Angeles. I want to thank Gene and Brother Trombley. Uh, we've been working hard to make sure that today's call was successful filling all of our labor, getting the guys out here, turning two, and uh, hopefully by five o'clock today, we'll have about 2,300 cans off this vessel. So thank you all for being here, and uh, please, CGM, bring some more ships. Yeah. Oh, picture already. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, how's that possible?